Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Bilal and you are watching Bilal Mobile's RYK YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix iPhone stuck on white screen after the iOS 18 update. If your iPhone is stuck on a white screen, there are a few potential causes and solutions. Here are some steps you can try to fix your iPhone white screen issue. Number one is force restart your iPhone. Press and hold the sleep wake button and the volume down button and the same time at least 10 seconds until you see the apple logo appears on screen this can sometimes resolve the issue press the volume up button volume down button press the power button until you see apple logo appears on screen when you see apple logo appears on screen simply fix your problem if solution number one is not working now applying the solution number Two. Solution number two is connect to iTunes. Connect your iPhone to your computer and open iTunes. If iTunes recognizes your own iPhone, you may be able to restore it to a previous backup and fix your problem. If solution number two is not working, now applying this solution number three. Solution number three is DFU restore. If the above steps don't work you may need to perform a dfu device firmware update restore to do this connect your iphone to computer open itunes and press and hold the sleep wake button for three seconds then press and hold the volume down button while still holding the sleep wake button release the sleep wake button but keeps holding the volume down button for 10 seconds and download the file and fix your problem if solution number two is not working, three is not working, now applying the solution number four. Solution number four is check for physical damage. If your iPhone has been exposed to water or physical stress, it may be causing the widescreen issue. This is cause you may need to have it repaired or replaced. Visit an Apple store if none of the above steps work it may be best to visit an apple store or authorized service provider for further assistance remember to always back up your iphone regularly to prevent data loss in case you need to restore or replace it i hope this helps let me know if you have any other question if video is helpful for you please don't forget to share and subscribe my youtube channel thanks for watching